Today, I want to start talking about the fundamental theorems of calculus as it pertains to ENM. So the most fundamental theorem of calculus is this. Oh, it should be B to A, right? Can I also write this as that? Okay, knowing this, what does that tell you about F? What is f a function of? Just x, correct? I see two people said, wait, said, said the same thing, right? Now, what if, so that's absolutely perfect. That means f is a function of x only. That is why I am allowed to do this. Now, what about the situation where f is not only a function of x, but in fact, it's a function of x, y, and z? In that case, how does our system change? Okay, so that's what we have to do now. So if the, we have that situation where f is function of more than one variable, what can I have? Well, in integral calculus, I can say, Fundamentally, there are three basic things that can happen. And those are called fundamental theorems, by the way. So there could be, uh, what are the three things we talked about? Uh, gradient, divergence, and curl. Perfect. What do you think these three will be? Gradient. The same thing. Divergence and curl. The same exact thing. Okay. So we will have gradient. We will have divergence. And we will have curl. Gradient was when the del operator operated on a scalar. Divergence was when the del operator had a dot product with a scalar. Curl was the cross product with a vector. Okay, so in case of gradient, I also called it the slope. And, and I have to come up with fancy names for this, for divergence. It is so important that it has three different names. It is called the Gauss theorem, the Gauss's theorem. It is also called the Green's theorem, and it is also called the Divergence theorem. So it is so important that they, we have given it three different names. When we take the curl, we call it the Strokes Theorem. Now I'm gonna give you these all at once. Let's write them 
at once and then I'll explain how each of them developed and what they mean. That's, that's, the, that's the job for today. Okay, so slope or the gradient, I'm gonna do blue, is written as A to B, del operating on a scalar, dot DL gives you TB minus TA. Divergence theorem E dot DA. Bear with me, I haven't explained it yet. I'm just making you write it and I'll explain it in a second. I just wanna finish this table. We'll just come back. And stroke theorem. So I'm gonna write this down. This is going to be over the surface del cross E, cause it's the curl DA equal over the path E dot DL. Okay, now I want you to leave some room underneath all of these so we can write more later, but let me address each of them separately. 